In today's video, we've got another two minute fix. We're going to switch out the caps on our low point drains with something a bit more convenient. Now, as the name indicates, low point drains are the valves that are located at the lowest point in your camper. Open these up and you can drain the last of the water out of the lines prior to winterizing or storing the camper long term. Now we haven't had this issue, but we have seen others that have had these caps break or crack and that allows water to drip out or you may just be tired of crawling underneath the camper with tools to take them off every time you want to drain the lines. Either way, this is a cheap and easy two minute fix. So let's talk parts. Now, as Troy mentioned, we haven't had a problem with our drain caps, so this is kind of a preemptive fix for us, but we have seen online people that have had um, a problem with those being cracked, and this was the solution that was suggested, so thank you to who originally you know, thought of this idea. But we went in down to our local Home Depot and purchased these. These are half inch PVC ball valves. So I will leave the, in the description the link to the Home Depot listing, but no matter what hardware store you walk into, a major one, you should be able to find something very similar. So there is a few benefits that we see um, in using these rather than just the caps. One of them is, you know, it just makes it super easy to drain the lines when we come back from a trip. We can just, you know, hit this valve open and close and let the water drain while we're doing other things. And to that, before when we would remove the cap, um, we would usually go ahead and you know do some other things while the water was draining out. And it wouldn't be unheard of, we haven't done it, but it wouldn't be unheard of, of to forget and you know have maybe that cap in your bar back pocket or leave it laying down somewhere and lose it. So the benefit to these are you don't have to remove them from the camper to go ahead and open up the valves. So right now, Troy's gonna show you how easy it is to go ahead and just replace them. Now after you go ahead and pull the caps off, drain the water out of the water lines, you can go ahead and put these valves on. You may need a little help here because these valves are very close together and you're going to have to hold them apart a little bit so it may, you may need somebody to help you. Yeah, so that's it. They're both installed reasonably tight should be just fine at this point i want to take the handles and turn them perpendicular to the pipe to make sure the ball valves are closed so there you have today's two minute fix if you'd like to see more of these types of activities please hit that subscribe button have a great week